All right, thank you, Ben. All eyes were on this woman right there at the Bill Cosby sex assault retrial today, and the jurors could not look away. For the second time, Andrea Constan testified about being drugged and assaulted by a man once seen as America's dad. NBC's Jay Gray has her story and how the defense team will try to fight back. The first week of Bill Cosby's retrial closes with Andrea Constant, his chief accuser on the witness stand. I'm just imagining that it must be very hard for her. Her allegations of sexual assault are the only among dozens against the entertainer that have led to criminal charges. Led by prosecutors, Constant outlined what she says began as a mentor relationship with Cosby, one that abruptly changed in January of 2004 when she alleges he drugged and molested her at his suburban Philadelphia mansion. During today's testimony, Constan told jurors, I wanted it to stop and I was trying to get my hands and legs to move, but the message wasn't getting there. I was limp and I could not fight him off. I was humiliated, in shock and confused. Cosby's defense team has said Constan's motivation in the case is money. They point to a more than $3 million settlement made by the star to avoid a civil trial. His team also says there are inconsistencies between today's testimony and what Constan said under oath during the original trial. She should be a seamstress because she's good at altering her story. It's one of several issues expected to be at the center of an aggressive cross-examination from lead defense attorney Tom Mesereau. Jay Gray, Local 4.